All right, peoples, I'm back. And when you Q-tip, you want to spray your uh, Windex on the Q-tip first. That's the way I do it, at least. That way you don't get stuck with a whole bunch of excess bullshit that you don't fucking want. And then I will spray one side. God damn, look at that shit. Already. Now I'll leave the other side dry. When I get the Q tip, I will get in like all the crevices. Y'all fucking missing that, damn. I'll get to that last screw it. Usually I like the clean inside of these uh, little areas with the Q-tip also. And I prefer to use um, like electronics wipes versus a uh, fucking paper towel, but that's all I got on me. So I, I've been meaning to make a run to goddamn the electronics section at Walmart to get Re up on my cleaning shit. Then um, I'll try and get down into the screw holes to pressure there and there. Gunk out of that motherfucker. And I don't know if you can tell, but um, right there. So it says zero seven. So they've been punching numbers in labels over there at Nintendo for a long time now. Super Nintendo games and 64 games. If you want to know if it's true, look for a fucking stamped number somewhere. It's usually on the front label, but on these NES cartridges, they're on the back label. Oddly enough. So, uh, if it's figured, there we go. You can see 0707. Really good now. Yeah. So, I thought that was kind of cool seeing that come up good when I was cleaning. What the fuck's that little smudge right there? And, too, with the Q tip, you can go back and, like, get any little. Fucking smudges you might have missed. Man, you are really fucking dirty. There's all sorts of crud in there that I fucking missed. So I'm not going to waste your guys' time with showing you uh, the whole goddamn me cleaning. But you know, I guess I can burn another minute and another Q-tip I'll clean up that top part since that's really the dirtiest part. And then we'll move to the inside of the cartridge. Right, you guys see how nasty and Fucky that is. And sometimes if it is really nasty, you gotta go over it twice anyway because that first go is going to like break a lot of the shit up. Like get it loose. Get the cleaning solution into it. 
And then you go over it the second time, and it's really loosened the fuck up. So you know it's squeaky clean, baby. And we're looking good. What do you guys think? We're looking good? We're looking good. Alright, next up. We're going to tackle these pins. No, you guys really can't see how truly, like, kind of dirty they really are, but, um, you'll see in a minute when I, uh, pulled a Q-tip off it. Alright. And drink the rest of this beer in part three, coming up soon.